Five counties in our region moving into the yellow phase next Friday spent much of this past week making sure their voices were heard in Harrisburg and it seems to have paid off. County leaders wrote letters and proposals while area business owners and residents held rallies to reopen. Eyewitness News reporter Kevin Hayes joins us live with more on what it means to those counties to take a, a step toward normal. Kevin. Well, Nick, some say this is long overdue, others still a bit skeptical, but the fact remains five counties in our region, they get the next week to try and get ready for entering that yellow phase of the governor's reopening plan, but as safely as possible. After almost two months of stay at home orders, another round of counties will move into the yellow phase. Everybody's been getting very antsy here and, and, and wanting to get back into the flow, and I trust that they'll be safe. And, and put everyone's safety and concerns first during our opening. Open our county. While there have been some protests, these social distancing and sanitizing practices have paid off from Wyoming and Wayne counties and beyond. We have our citizens and our businesses have been very compliant in following the protocols to flatten the curve and reduce the spread. Lightly impacted counties like Susquehanna think they are ready to reopen without that leading to a rise in the number of cases. We have to continue to work together so that we don't have a spike in cases so that we can move forward safely into the green phase. Others like Columbia, who had a resolution to go yellow on the 15th, but are now agreeing to stay in the red phase for one more week after the governor's order put them in the next round of counties to reopen on the 22nd. We're one step closer to normal. Uh, we have a lot of colors to go through yet. Carbon County leaders say while they have been devastated by the blow to small businesses and tourism, they have a clear path forward. Uh, their inability to open up so far this year uh, is really taking a toll on these people. And if we don't get some things moving soon, a lot of these businesses will not survive. We cannot relax that we're going to yellow. That's going to be a big mistake for all of us. Now, many elected officials we spoke to today ready and raring to go to get people out of their homes, local business doors open, but many also agreeing that this needs to be an all-hands-on-deck situation between those businesses and these neighbors to make sure that these counties that are moving to the yellow phase get to stay there for now. Live in Jim Thorpe tonight, Kevin Hayes, Eyewitness News.